Hi and welcome to a Kirby Maths video about the mode, the median and the range and finding these values from a list. So as you can see here I have written out definitions of the mode, the median and the range and I have a list of numbers here. So this is our data set and the mode is the most common value or the value which appears the most times and the way I remember it is that mode begins with MO and most also begins with MO. So that's the most common value. The median is a little bit more tricky to find. First of all, you have to put the data in numerical order. So starting with the smallest and going up to the biggest. And then you have to find the middle value. And I will show you how to do that uh, shortly. If there are two middle values, so if you have an even number of data items, then it is the middle of those values. And if they're the same, then it is just uh, the value that is the same. And the range is probably the easiest to find. That is the highest value, take away the lowest value. And that would give you the range of the data set. So let's have a look at the mode first of all. The mode is the most common value. And in this case, if we have a look through, uh, we can see that three occurs one, two, three times and there is no other number. We've got two 12s, uh, but we've got no other number that occurs three times. So in this case, the mode is three. To find the median, we need to put the data in order. So if we start off with our smallest number, we've got three, three, three. We've then got a four and a five and a six. Uh, we then go to a nine and two twelves. If you're doing this on a piece of paper normally you would cross them off as you go so that you know that you've got um, those ones written down. Uh, we've then got a 15 and a 17 and I hope that's all of them. So let's count up how many we had to start with. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Hooray, we've got 11 pieces of data. Then to find the median, I usually cross them off from either end. Now you can use a different colour or you can um, just use the same colour, but it is key not to obliterate the numbers so you can still see the numbers in case you need to go back and use them again. So I do a line going this way to cross off the three at that end and that matches up with the one there. And can you see I've done my uh, lines in a different direction so I can cross off the pairs so I know where I am. This one crosses off with this one. 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 And that leaves me one number in the middle. So in this case, the median is six. And finally, the range is the highest value, take away the lowest value, and it's really helpful if you've put the data, data in order uh, from finding the median, then you'll be able to see what your highest value and your lowest value is. So in this case, it's 17 take away 3, which is 14. So the range of that set of data is 14. Thank you for watching.